welcome back to Apps and Zerts. Today we are at the beautiful Disneyland Resort to try all of their fun holiday foods. We are going to hit up Disneyland and try all of their fun holiday foods. We're going to go over to California Adventure and have their holiday foods. And we're going to go over and do the Festival of Holiday Marketplace booths. I'm super excited. There's tons of fun stuff to eat and we are going to go and we're going to try as much as we can. So come along with me and we'll try everything. the shawarma palace to try out this Avengers shawarma. It's chicken shawarma with a um, yogurt sauce and vegetables and it comes in a very thick though crumbly pita. Let's give it a try and see how it is. Mmm! I like it! That's good. The, um, the flavor that stands out the most, aside from the pita because there's so much pita, is the yogurt sauce. Um, it definitely has a vinegary taste, so like kind of like pickled vegetables and that yogurty taste. So if you're not super into like vinegary flavors, you might not like it because that's the flavor that most like shines through, but it's very warm um, and the chicken has good seasoning on it. So I enjoy it. Um, I think this probably isn't gonna be for everybody, but I like it, it's good. It's a tasty protein filled snack. Buzz's churros. This is a churro covered in hot tamale flavored like dust. Look at the cool packaging. I think that's awesome. Okay, let's give this a try. I'll tell you how it is. Mmm. Really good. It's still very cinnamony, which is awesome. Um, but definitely has that spicy kick. Hot tamale flavor. It's really good. It still has a lot of cinnamon in it, but it's got that little kick, that little spicy kick, which I really like. Not too spicy, but um, it just tastes really good like hot tamales. I love it. Here's uh, Bo Peep behind me. Hey, girl. Jolly Holiday brought back their Thanks Miss sandwich, although this year it's just called the holiday sandwich. Um, I'm really excited that they brought this back. I've loved this when I tried it in the past. Uh, it's very popular. The line was very long for lunch, but I'm super happy I got my sandwich. It does come with two of these size and a bag of kettle chips. So let's give it a try. See if it's as good as uh, what I've had in the past. Mmm. So good. I love it. Again. Like I said in the past, I think the cranberry sauce makes it. Oh, it's so good. Such a hearty bite. Like, it really is, like, leftover Thanksgiving meal just in a sandwich. It's so good. And they do give you a little dipping um, sauce gravy on the side, so you can dip it in the gravy, um, which I'm going to go sit down on a chair under my umbrella and do that and have a wonderful time at the Jolly Holiday Cafe. But yeah, I love that they brought this back.
entrance to Avengers Campus, we found a booth called A Twist on Tradition. And we found a delicious looking, deconstructed or reimagined, I guess, beef wellington. It is a tasty little treat. It's got a Mickey shaped puff pastry with all kinds of succulent beef on the top. It looks warm and delicious and I'm gonna give it a try. Let's see how it is. dish that your grandma would make on the holidays. The beef is savory and I love that they paired it with cilantro because it kind of gives it a little bit of a fresher kind of kick. I think it mixes really well to, together. The flavors are really well balanced. It's hearty and it's warm and the puff pastry is really really soft and no it just it's it's like a warm home-cooked meal in a little Mickey shaped bite. I absolutely love this. From the grandma's recipe booth, I got a couple interesting things. The first one is called the berries and crema, and it is a little, it's not quite a smoothie, it's more of a liquidy drink. I admit I did have a sip before I, I came on camera, sorry about that guys. <laughs> but it's um, really fruity and delicious and refreshing, and it's got fruity pebble bits on top and a um, kind of like a cold foam. So anyways, it's really good. Um, it's got huckleberry, and it's even got some holiday spices too, but it makes a really interesting milky mix that kind of tastes similar to like cereal and milk. And the cereal bits that kind of get sucked up in the straw give it a fun little crunch. So this is a really, really good one. Especially if you like Fruity Pebbles, you're gonna love like all of the flavors in this. It's really, really good. Also from Grandma's Recipes, I picked up this little number. You may have recognized this from a previous video that I did when I was here at the Festival of Holidays a few years ago. And the reason I got it again was because out of all of the gingerbread cookies that I, try, I have tried at Disneyland over the years, this one is my favorite. It comes with like a light glaze on top, and then it has like these sprinkles, but it's also really, like the texture is really good. It's soft and chewy and the spice blend and the like the medley of gingerbread spices is also really, really good. So this is like the best gingerbread cookie that Disney puts out in my opinion. And of course, I'm gonna take a bite and try it for you, but I'm probably gonna bring the rest home. I also love this one because, because it comes in a little bag, um, so you can take it home if you want to get, if you're getting too full trying all of the Festival of Holiday Foods. But anyways, enough talking, let's get to the good part. It's perfect, perfect gingerbread. I love it. From the Winter Sliderland booth, uh, we have this bourbon cranberry cocktail and it comes with this like cute little trio of sugared cranberries right on top. Um, but I know that I'm gonna want this drink to be sweet, so I'm gonna stick it in and stir it up here before I give it a try. Let's see how this is. Ooh, that blend of flavors is fantastic. Normally I don't like bourbon. It's a little bit strong of a flavor for me, but this, I'm not sure what's all in here. I know it's obviously cranberry juice and bourbon, but the flavors go so well together. And it's sweet. Like neither cranberry nor bourbon is like sweet, but this drink is sweet. That's delicious and super refreshing. Um, really, really good. I really, really enjoy this cocktail. I think 
the mix of the bourbon and the cranberry flavors really makes me just feel like I'm on this like holiday high because they're both very like warm Christmassy or, or holiday flavors but at the same time the drink is like so refreshing um, and like light and sweet it's really good I'd highly recommend this even if you think you don't like bourbon like give this one a try this one's really good From Terran Treats, I had to try this Cosmic Cream Orb. This is supposed to be like a cream puff, but with raspberry filling. And I've been seeing this all over social media and I had to give it a try. So I'm gonna break it open here. Can you see that raspberry filling? That's incredible. Oh, this looks so good. Okay, I'm gonna take a messy bite. Whoa. It's good. The inside is raspberry cheesecake flavored. That's really good. And there's chocolate on the bottom. It's really good. The cream puff is squishy and the filling inside the raspberry cheesecake is cold and fresh. It tastes really good. I really like this. Yum. <laughs> together at Disneyland over the holiday season. We got to do festival holiday foods. We got to do just regular holiday foods. Disneyland, California Adventure. I had such a good time and I ate so much. It was so awesome to bring you along with me. Thank you so much for watching this video. We would love you to subscribe to our channel, Apps and Zerts. Join our Apps and Zerts family. Um, we would love to have you subscribe and follow us for more of this delicious sweet treat content and interact with me in the comments. Tell me what you want me to review next. Tell me what you would want to try if you come to Disneyland during the holidays. And we would love to see you next time. Thanks for coming along. So remember, if we are what we eat, then we're all sugary sweets.